I don't know what you can say. Oh, what were you going to say? Okay, see I'm about to say. See what the new anyway. engine is the pit bike? <laughs> might, might be buying a brand new engine, guys, just pretending if we fixed it. Okay, guys, so we're off to the garage again. Basically, if you didn't watch the last video, go check it out because we ran into a little bit of a nightmare. The problem we've got, right, is that when we finished last time, I was all like, you know, I'm buying a new engine, can't be bothered to put it back together, it's a piece of shit. Might as well get a new engine because it's cheap. So we threw all the pieces in a box and just left them. So now we're gonna try and rebuild this, but all the pieces are everywhere. They're kind of dirty, they're just shoved in a box. So we've got to find out where everything goes, figure out how to put it back together. But I thought it'd be quite fun to see if we can get it running again. If we can get it running, it's a bonus. If we can't, then we suck and I'll just have to buy a new engine. Okay, we got the parts. I haven't actually opened them, so I don't know if they're the right ones. So this is the moment of truth. Interesting. They look the same. That gear is longer than that gear. So we'll probably have to strip this down and do it like that. These are the bits that we found in the engine. The teeth from the gears. Oh, we're just trying to see if the pieces fit. So this is the new one, yeah? Yeah. Okay, so obviously the parts don't fit. <laughs> obviously, because I ordered them. So what we're gonna do now is get the original piece and the new piece. We're just gonna take some gears off the new ones, put them on the old ones, because some of the gears on the new ones don't fit the old ones. Because mine's not 125, which Mikey thought it was. It is a 125. It's not 125, it's a 110, but anyway. So that's the old one. That's the new one. We're gonna put bits from that one onto this one. Guys, just so you all know, I didn't actually buy a gasket kit for the, uh, for the engine. We're gonna seal it, the sealant. I, I do have a feeling that when we put this all back together, there's still going to be some bits in that box. We've got the engine back together. I say we, I mean him. But it's done. So, so far, this, we don't know where it goes. So this is the first of the spare bits. This could be a lot by the end. Uh, you on. don't sound confident well, you're not. that it's going to start. A start? Yeah. Well, you don't think it'll run? It might run. It's got two choices, isn't it? Fuck's sake. Okay, guys, we're nearly there. We've got it back together. Have we got it back together? Yeah, we have. Yeah. We've got it back together. True bromance over here. God, I don't know what you do without me. Have an easy life. <laughs> okay, guys, we've come to the end. We're just doing a spanner check. Spanner, check. Uh... The engine is in. Well, nearly in. Not long till the moment of truth. This thing's a dick. Guys, you can get these great graphics. Just come down to Mikey's Body Shop and uh, it's about £3,000 for each one because they are top notch. <laughs> Three quid, my life. <laughs> Not even that. Any Pfizer. I'm sorry. I apologise. Just for that, I'm cursing your bike. Well, don't do that. Well, guys, moment of truth. Are you ready? It's on, bro. Are you ready? Hang on. Tune in next time. <laughs> <laughs> Spray it out. 
<laughs> right guys, so we were I was gonna tease you and do the old start at the beginning of the next video. Didn't fucking start. Didn't fucking start. Just for that, I'm cursing your bike. So we've tried everything. Well, we have. Well, not everything. I mean, we'll, I mean, we haven't checked we the spark. We haven't done, we haven't done all the simple it. stuff. But basically, what happened was the kickstart goes down and stays down. And when I'm riding along in gear, I say riding along, it doesn't work. Pushing. But pushing. When we're riding along, as soon as you put it into gear to try and bump start, the kickstart just falls down to the floor. So if any of you know why that is, leave it in the comment section below, please. I was expecting a grand finale, mate. Well, to be fair, we haven't done what we should do mechanically. Like, we need to check that it's got air, it's got fuel, it's got spark. And air, fuel, spark. And then if not, we're taking that casing off. And Again. We'll see it. No, not the gear casing, because gears feel fine, but the engine side with the kickstart, because there's something wrong with the springers, it's not springing back. So that might be causing it, that maybe we can't get enough of a kick on it. Either way, it's not working. All right, so, course, hey, it's not your fault, mate. You fucking put 100% effort into that. 110, actually. This guy's a legend. Don't be fooled. Hey, I did myself out of 10%, then. <laughs> <laughs> right, well, anyway, yeah, it didn't start, so I'll try and do another video where we go through it again, take it apart again and uh, try and get it working and find out what the problem is. A lot of we. There's a lot of we. There's Mikey's going to do it and I'm just going to watch. I don't know what you're going to say. Oh, what are you going to say? Okay, see I'm going to say. See what, the new anyway. engine for the pit bike? <laughs> might, might be buying a brand new engine, guys, just pretending if we fixed it. <laughs> As always, thanks for watching. Ride safe and I'll catch you on the next one. Peace. Peace.